Today in the grain market, corn was up. Futures did gain some momentum, uh, mostly on the strength of the soybean complex. South America is having some issues making it necessary to have a flawless uh, production this summer for corn. That's something to watch as we go forward. Uh, the volume is really starting to get back up again. Uh, option volatility is steady. It hasn't expanded uh, as we uh, thought, but maybe as we continue to move, uh, that would be something that would be expected. Uh, traders are now opening more uh, call options in the 610 calls. That has been the most active going forward. And of course, that's a little bit higher than where we are. Perhaps that's a little bit of an indication that the market is really gaining a little strength. Now, soybeans were very strong today. The uh, trend does remain up. It's really closing in on a new high right now, uh, even though the market is kind of running out of bullish news to keep the market churning higher. But there's a few things to be watching for. Brazil is behind on their harvest. They're only at 35%. And there is, and there is talk that there is a quality uh, issue uh, that uh, actually could add a little more support to the U.S. markets. Now, Argentina is dry as well. So those are things that we're going to be looking at over the uh, next couple of days. The April uh, option uh, volatility did jump up a lot. Open interest is really at this at the highest that it's ever been for April at about 80,000 contracts. Uh, so that just says that there's a, like bigger participation in the market. Even the put call ratio is a little bit lower and that just has traders uh, somewhat hesitant. Can we make another big surge? So each day we're going to watch that as we close in on the last few days of February um, by Friday. Now wheat did surge today as well. The uh, worries in the uh, damage has been a uh, front and center concern. The assessment though could take some time. Now the market did break out of the channel that it was in from 6.30 to 6.70. It really uh, did make a big push and right now it's uh, maybe quickly testing that new high at 6.93. Now uh, yesterday uh, the option of uh, volatility did kind of uh, contract by 2% because the market was pretty steady. But today it expanded back out and then some. That just says there's a lot more uh, option trading uh, going forward and we expect that to continue as all the grains continue to rally.